All new at five o'clock, a multi-billion dollar deal we've talking about, uh, talked about bringing a majority owner now to the Dallas Mavericks, whose last name is not Cuban. Her name <laughs> is Miriam Adelson of Las Vegas. Yeah, this is a power move, and it's a power move positioning the Adelson family as big players in the sports world. Ken Molestina showing us a closer look at who Miriam Adelson is. Billionaire Miriam Adelson is a medical doctor by trade. She's also the widow of Las Vegas tycoon Sheldon Adelson. And just this year, she was named the 35th richest person in the world by Forbes. She's also the largest shareholder of international casino and resort company, the Las Vegas Sands Corporation. Really, how deep are the Adelson pockets? They have very deep pockets, and they're people that are very, very powerful. So uh, when it comes to the Adelsons, I would never bet against them. To learn more about Adelson and her family, I checked in with a longtime personal friend who's very familiar with the Adelson family name. Harry Rees is a play-by-play -play announcer for the Las Vegas Raiders, the same team the Adelsons are credited for leading the efforts to relocate from Oakland to Las Vegas just a few years ago. You've seen the way that family handles their business with the Raiders. Uh, what, what can we expect as their business style when they come to Dallas? Yeah, they're aggressive. They go for the big money. They go for the home runs in an industry out in Vegas where it's dominated by Caesars, by MGM. Uh, you got loners like Steve Wynn, like the Adelson family, that they got their own part of the strip as well because they don't want to associate with other people. They want to be the ones in charge. And as new majority owners of the Mavs, they will be in charge for most everything except basketball operations, which will still be headed by Mark Cuban. Ruiz says this purchase proves the Adelsons are serious about making lucrative moves in professional sports. The franchise, all that value that is going to keep increasing, that's going to go to the Adelson family. So they know that their money is in good hands because all the NBA franchises, all the NFL franchises, the value just keeps going up. So they know it's a smart investment. I'm Ken Molestina, CBS News, Texas. I'm sitting here listening to that, just trying to figure out how do we get on the Christmas card list?